Yes. Right, in this video I want to talk about rounding numbers to the nearest ten, hundred and thousand. And what we do is if we want to round this to the nearest ten, we look at the unit digit. And if it's more than, if it's five or more, we round it up. And if it's less than five, we round it down. And because this is a four, we round sixty down, four down to sixty. Okay? Now... First I want to round 236 to the nearest 10, right, so I'll look at the units digit again, which is 6, and because it's 6 I round it up to 240, and now for around 240 to the nearest 100, I'll look at the tens digit, which is 4, 4 is less than 5, so I'll round that down to 200, right, now I want to round 1,459 to the nearest thousand. So we'll look at the hundreds digit, that's a four. So we'll round it down to a thousand. And we want to round it to the nearest hundred. And the second digit, and the tenth digit is a five. So we'll round it up to 1,500. Right, and now we want to round it to the nearest 10 and we'll look at the units, which is a 9, so we'll round it up to 1,460. Now this one we want to round to the nearest 10, the units are 1, so we'll round that to 260. Tens is, the tens column is a 6, so we'll round that up to 300. Next one here. All around it, the nearest 10, I get 3890 because the units is a 1. On around this to the nearest 100's now, 100 now, I look at the tens column, that's a 9, so I round it up to 3900. Now I look at the hundreds column here, which is a 9, because it's a 9, I round it up to 4000. Okay, so if we want to round up the, the nearest 10, we'll look at the units column. If we want to round up the nearest 100, we'll look at the tens column. And if we want to round up the nearest 1000, we'll look at the hundreds column. And you round up if it's 5 or more, and you round down if it's less than 5. Okay.